Look at this. This could be some money right here. Oh, I love storage units because it's like Christmas. Uh, it shouldn't have. Star Trek. Star Wars. Ooh, come on. Come on. Oh, yes. Yes. we do today Roberts they've auctioned an extraordinary and I bought this unit for $520 and it's been a time capsule stuff from the 50s 60s 70s 80s 90s who knows what else is gonna be here you can tell boxes and boxes and boxes if you haven't seen the first video gotta check it out don't forget it's free subscribe hit the bell get all your notifications so you guys don't miss any of the awesome finds at Second Sense and you can buy the stuff at www.secondsense.com so it was way more than Jeff and I thought, that's for sure. It's still packed. It's still packed. So, let's start at the top. Oh, this could be good. It's a speaker. 8538. That's what it is. Oh, yeah. For any speaker. Everyone loves the eight, 835s. They're one of my, my favorites, but it's the 853. 53. Oh. <laughs> I have one of those like 835s, though. Okay. Oh, no way. Batman. Batman. Such a cool t-shirt. Vintage goodness. Ooh. This guy definitely has some vintage tees in here. This Star Spangled Banner Monument. Look then. Okay. So who knows? I mean, we'll have to go through all these t-shirts. Just the Batman tee. Pays for the unit for me. <laughs> Bush Bear. These are all vintage tees. Budweiser. King of Bears. Look at this. Man, this whole thing is filled. These just regular t-shirts? Or... This might just be a whitey's. <laughs> like Hulk Hogan. We'll have to go through. Pull out all the... Look at Reese Peanut Butter Cups. This is a good box right here. Vintage tees. And that. I think Batman will fit me. Oh, okay, we got a pair. I think it'll fit. 858's Jeff. Reindeer from Bob. Reindeer. From Bob. It looks like Bob. It looks like Rudolph. <laughs> and clothes. Ralph Lauren jeans. These can't be cheap. Size 14. That's your size. What's that translate in men? I don't know, Jeff. I think if I were a women's size, I'd probably be about a 24. These are all Loren Jean Company, though. You might want to keep those. I'm sure they have some value. Electric Christmas cord? There's Electric Christmas. Electric Christmas, Jeff. Okay. <laughs> Santa Claus. And we got old ornaments in here. Old Christmas. You want a bird in your tree? I always wanted to give you the bird, Jeff. Books, books, more books. Oh yeah! Now we're talking. Money, money, money. And I just had something to say. Now I'm gonna forget it. All right, well, say it. Oh, on the last video, you asked me if I had something to say. And you caught me off guard. I thought about it. I have something. What? I just want to say hi, Debbie Wells. Can't make everyone else bad. Huh? Can't make everyone else feel bad. No. Debbie so said has been saying hi longer to me than anybody. This is all tarot cards. So even at 20 bucks a piece, but some of these could be $50, $100 decks. So that the stack of money. This says these ex employee stuff. This is all paperwork. Ex employees paperwork? He has employees. I used to have employees. Yeah. No, I am an employee. I'm hey you. Hey just Jeff, go move that. Hey just Jeff, lift that. I guess that's Ken's books and tarot cards. Hey just Jeff, the bathroom's dirty. Yeah, speaking of which. How often do I ever hear, hey just Jeff, you hungry? He's on the bathroom. Oh, come on. 
says tarot cards. That's, that's tarot cards, Voyager. Oh my gosh, that's probably expensive. There's a bunch of books here. Some more tarot card type things. Those like tell your horoscopes, right? Yeah, Jeff, I can tell you. Have your you ever heard right that now. thing? <laughs> Not looking too bright. No. Well, I went to I went into the one time to the fortune teller, and I said, and I got there, and it said be back in ten minutes. I said, obviously she's no good. She didn't know I was coming. That's a good point. All right. Yeah. You go to. Uh, 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 Someone that doesn't even know you're coming. <laughs> hey, Robert. What? Exercise time's over. Let's go. We got work to do. We got work to do. I was just trying to keep you cool with the fan, dude. Oh, yeah. Dry you off. It's Why don't you work faster past me and okay, keep okay. me cool? All right, there's just so much stuff left in this unit. We've been trying to load up so many books, guys. Getting rid of the books like it's brand new, old stock, a little silver plate warmer, and uh, Easter baskets. That's what it looks like. And a speaker. Say no rhyme, no reason. Storage unit's fun. Look at that dirt on there. Whew. Oh, stuffed animals. So I got some good news and bad news. All right. All Let's right. Puff the magic dragon. Well, while I've been doing all this driving today, oh. I've had time to think, and I I come up with a couple of excellent thoughts for you. Wow. Okay. Well, it might be me. What did I tell you about thinking? Some. So well, someone mentioned the fan club, and I I think about your videos, and I thought you know, the fan club thing's pretty small. It's my mom, my dog, and one person. So I would like to think maybe. Like when I go home at night, in the evening I'll look at the videos and pe when people say nice things it feels good and I sleep all good. Uh -huh. So I think I want to start an official Just Jeff friend club. Oh, friend club? Yeah, so if you say nice things you're in the friend club. <laughs> and then and then I'll sleep better at night. How about free batteries? Come on, man. Everyone in the friend club gets free batteries. Just Jeff friend club, please. Okay. You approve of it? This is really what you just you thought about. Will you endorse me? Oh, I had you another turn thought. Radio on. I'm not going to hit you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to hit you with both my thoughts in one shot. Oh, good. I had I drove like 160 miles today. That's it. 160. Actually, not as many today. Last two days. Maybe these thoughts been brewing. Okay. You know what else has been brewing? This unit for years. All right, I'm throwing my other one at you too. Now, what the heck? You're just you're just messing with stuff. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do for. Once again, somehow I guess these thoughts are about me, but as a oh, what was my thought now? I don't know. Oh, that's what I want to do. I I spent a lot of time and effort. That's that's beautiful. Oh, that's your, yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, that excites you. Oh, man, look at I don't have all the Z glasses. See, Hopefully you're messing more. up with my thought. 137 Kentucky Derby? Go ahead. What's your thought? That's going to take me a second to remember now. Oh. Maybe maybe some of my oh, thoughts are... <laughs> Stop it. Maybe some of my thoughts stem more than just about you. Maybe they're more about me, but I'm thinking... Ooh, pitcher? I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a best. I'm gonna put Plastic together. Up. Stop it. I'm gonna put together a best of Jeff collection for you. A montage. I'm gonna go. Th I'm gonna spend my time and go through all of them, and I'm gonna put through a best of Jeff. Because, uh, quite honestly, I cracked myself up. So, I want to watch some just Jeff saying stupid stuff. You laugh at your own jokes? So, so if anyone, actually, if anyone can remember any, like, best, best of Jeff's and can say this episode about this time mark, because I'm going to, I'm going to go back through, through, what, what have I been working for you, like three months? I'm going to go back through the whole three months. And the or best of Jeff's. Last. And I'm, I'm putting together 
putting together a best of Jeff. Well, here's the best of something. Look at this. This would be some money right here. Holy All right, back smoke. to you. Yeah, I'm back done. To the, back to the... Those are my two thoughts. Tomorrow I'll think more. McCartan? Do the first one. What's the Neil first oh, one? Is that Neil Diamond? Oh. Neil Diamond, love songs. I thought it was Neil Young. Fleetwood Mac. Fleetwood Mac. Oh. ABC. The Temptations. What did, what did you call the guys at the shop uh, yesterday? Record snobs. The record snobs. The record snobs are going to love these. Casey and the Sunshine Band. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this thing's loaded. The Bee Gees. There's some good. There's some bad mixed in. But there's definitely... They look like they're in pretty good sh shape. Chicago. So yesterday I had a little time to kill while you're bidding on lockers, and I hung that sign for you, and I got to listen to the record snobs. John Denver, and they like to, yeah, they love their records. Don't they, they? Man, do they talk records? They know records. Condition Cheap every trick. song. That super tramp. That's that's. A <laughs> Cheech and Chong. Look at they're inside the van. If I pull it up, let's see how this opens. <laughs> uh, that's funny I got I got to admit I was heavily into Cheech and Chong back in the day oh yeah like the big bamboo they were awesome they made me laugh now the question is the paper in there it's in there what's that mean is that this is the paper it's a rolling paper it's a giant rolling paper okay is that more valuable well because everyone took it out and smoked it really yeah yeah, it's more valuable. Like it's a real rolling paper? Yeah. Rod Stewart. So did this pay for the locker now? Um, Are you saying that much? No. But it's definitely... It's going to average 20 bucks a piece or more, right? No, nah, well, there's some good ones in here. There's a lot of junk in here, too. They look like they're in great condition, though. Yeah, I would say my guesstimation on this would be minimum 200 up to 500. You said condition looks good. But that's a good sign. Are we going to find more records? All right, you're moving more fast books. on me. And we found books, books, so many books, huh, Jeff? Jeff's yes. actually opening his own library yeah. up. Half, half price book says, sir, could you not come back? <laughs> could you find some other half price? Ooh. I don't know. I like shiny boxes. This is kind of cool. You like shiny boxes. Sterling silver. On uh, the paperwork's in there. More jewelry boxes empty? Please find some jewelry. I'm hoping, Jeff, this box is empty. You would think that inside here somewhere, this one's just all the empty boxes, though. Or maybe not. Found a little pot and a Cheech and Chong album. <laughs> I didn't get that at first. Uh, you're either gonna you're either gonna find it all or nothing. That's where we're at right now. Maybe one box with just like just like loaded. Angels will sing and a, and a rainbow will come. I'm gonna start running. So who knows what we're gonna find in here. Flowers, gift bags, just such randomness with a bunch of these in there. These at your house stuff, you can hang your hats on them. This says hot. It appears to be unopened. But it feels like nothing's in there. Toner. What makes, what makes that hot? Is that fine? Time sensitive? Maybe. Hot deals, that's why. Mouse poop. You know what that means? Food. Possible. All boxed up. Portrait dolls? You ever find them before? Uh -uh. I don't think I have. Look at that. Who is it? Peggy Nivitz Portrait Doll. There's a tag on there. Queen Victoria. Made in England. 
holy smoke, this whole box is full. <laughs> Shakespeare. That's pretty neat. These gotta be worth some money. So now we're starting to get in some things here. Like once again, even if it had 10 bucks a piece, two, four, six, eight, ten of them. It's a hundred dollar box. Hundred dollar holler. I'm hoping they were 10 bucks a piece. We got Margaret Thatcher, Prince Charles, Winston Churchill. Man. Famous people from England. Unbelievable. You just never know what you're going to find at storage. And this is one of those ones you just don't know. So we've been going through. There's lots and lots and lots of books. So we get into this back wall, but I mean, there's had to be 60, 70 boxes of books. I don't even know. So many books. I found this box that says Kay's Personal Stuff. So hopefully, could be doing paperwork. Could have something good in here. There we go. Got a jewelry box right here. I, man, I'm sick of finding empty jewelry boxes, Jeff. Yeah. Did you come in and take all the jewelry? No. Okay. Right. Making sure. You know, I see, told you I was thinking about going back through all your videos and doing the best of Jeff. Uh -huh. I don't know if I could do that because I spend all day watching you. <laughs> I don't know if I could spend all evening. You could. Look at this. Jason Clipper binoculars. This could be worth a few bucks. Ooh, what is that? Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, you know what those are? Tarot cards. Old, old tarot cards. And tarot cards, especially old ones like this, are money. Money, money. Oh, what's that? What is that? <laughs> is that all you have to say about that? This. That's a cool looking box. That's what I'm saying. Man, there's a cool box. Dakota Watch Company, Auntie. We're gonna hit that, man. I'm with you, Jeff. We're gonna find all that. But that box. You're getting a good feeling. That's so neat. Cool. It is. I don't know if it's military or what. That's old. There's tons of them in here. Glasses for your visors for your glasses there, Jeff. Sight savers. Cards. Oh, look at that. Glows in the dark. What's it say? You're way too close. Well, I'm trying to get Arizona. the light on it. Yeah, because it's going to glow in the dark. Oh. You ready? You want me to turn the camera off? No. We're going to have to let us. Get it glowing longer than that. You're gonna, you're gonna take that home and play with it. I'll give it to the kids. It says fragility. <laughs> it's a computer. Old school. Old. Computer. Old. Old. More Ken stuff. Hopefully, it's better than last Ken stuff. Bottle of champagne. I told you I got a black suit out of there that fits me. That you had me take to. Uh... You have to wear it tomorrow to work, man. Then you can wear it to work, you know. Altoids? Oh my gosh, it really is Altoids. That's the giant, the biggest kind of Altoids I've ever seen. Premium staples. So there's no rhyme, no reasons for storage unit one. That's why we do it. Empty champagne bottle and things, office supplies. Um, new suit. New suit. I can't wait to see Jeff in the suit. Can I wear it tomorrow? Yeah. I'm going to dress for success. About time. Whatever's on the box it can't be in there. It's a glass dishes. Just empty bags. Something's down here. I guess. Coffee mugs. Alright. So we got... Ooh, look at this. Another jewelry box. Man. That's kind of cool. At some point there was a lot of jewelry. Where is it? Well, it could be someone took it, or they all put it. It's one. Like I see said. some bubble wrap down there, but I hope oh, it's wrapped nice. in all that bubble wrap. Oh, that's cool. Napoleon. That's a really cool statue. That's gonna be worth a few bucks. So no rhyme or reason. What's the bubble wrap in the very bottom? 
keyboard. Oh, keyboard. Huh. Strange, strange, strange. There's still 30 boxes left. Brand new stuff in here. Oh, it's not in there. I was hoping. That's in there. Hump. I'm here to call you up. So we got games. You unwrap that matches. box. Like a little goody man. Your poop. Uh, really? Yeah, it's in there. Hey, can I take that home and mess with my dog? <laughs> Poor dog. He'd be walking around like, hey, what's that? That's not me. That's not me, I swear. Oh, what's that? Found a watch. That's nice. Seiko. It's a start. It is a start. Maybe we'll find that jewelry. Just, just. Well, we're down to 10%. We're 90% through. And hey, that reminds me. Carpet cleaning kit. That that plunger you had me stick in there. Uh huh. I smelt it. I think it's used. Oh, okay. That's quite possible. Sometimes you want me to clean it or just clean it or pitch it. You can take it home. I could use them. All right, box fragility. Guys, bathroom stuff. Sometimes you can find jewelry and stuff in these. It's a nice rug. Here you go, Jeff. A little basket. What's in here? Powder. Hair Butter. clips. Toilet paper. White gold. White gold, baby. White gold, Jeff. Yeah. One of your favorites. Store lock. Stores lock or gold. Oh, some kind of box in here. Ooh, there's something in there. Got something in there. Kappa Alpha. So we got some vintage teas in here. Benedict in high school. This is awful. Vintage t-shirts. I don't know if there's anything good. We did find a tour shirt before. What the heck is that, Jeff? Something Berg run. Christopher De Berg, the getaway tour. 83. Huh. Not too familiar yeah. with that, but that could be a good good piece of cash money. A little down in here. We got a bunch of boxes here. So we were opening boxes. They had books or something. We just moved them to the side. Is it a sock? I don't know. Yes. <laughs> oh, money. I see a nickel. Some pennies. These are things you could always find some jewelry in here. Cigar box. Empty. Chocolates. They're in there, Jeff. Hmm. Well, that's one good thing. You got something to eat on the way home. Yeah. Put it on my heater and let it soften up a little bit. How long do you think this stuff's been in the storage? I don't think it's been in there 20 years. Well, I don't think 20 years. I'm thinking probably at least five. This is an indoor facility, so it's going to be tough to judge the dirt. Look at this. Is that, is that monkeys in a barrel? Monkeys in a barrel. We got Elmer Fudd. Tasmanian Devil. Crazy Wabbit. Crazy Wabbit. Pork. Oh, yeah, and earlier, look at we found this. And this is the, who I love storage units because it's like Christmas. Uh, you shouldn't have. You're welcome. Is that for me? I was gonna get you this, but you can have that one. Oh. So who knows? It's all kind of gifts already wrapped, scent candles, scent diffusers. What does this say? Candle garden. So I got Jeff's Christmas gift, chains, <laughs> chachis, mics. Yeah, you didn't mention your wife's name in that mess. Our K files. Cappuccino cups made in Germany. That's cool. What does it say on the bottom? 55 bucks. Gold rim. Demi toss cups. Nice. 
cigar box. <laughs> nice. Star Trek. Star Trek. Star Wars. Ooh, come on. Come on. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. That's what we're talking about. Princess Leia original with the vinyl cape. Obi-Wan Kenobi original with the vinyl cape. C-3PO. Oh, man. Stormtrooper. R2-D2. And we got, look at all them with all their weapons, accessories. These are Mago figures. So right there, that's easily $100, this box. Probably more. Wow. So vintage toys. Unbelievable. Do you know which one of those is the most rare set of the Star Wars? Um, I would say this one's probably the most valuable because he has the lightsaber. The tip's broken off. There's a little tip that comes out of there. But I would say with the vinyl cape, everything else, he's probably the most valuable or Princess Leia. Yeah, I thought maybe her. These are all Star Trek books. Oh, there's another box down here. Come on. <laughs> Little dial stuff. Washington, D.C. souvenir pin from 68. Washington DC, a pickle pin. This looks like a silver ring, and then we got a little Mickey Mouse and Woodstock. So I'm starting to add up here and there. There's definitely some interesting things, just lots and lots of books. Which Jeff likes books, so yeah. He don't really care about the book part. I've I've started a bunch of them in my life. There's one you can start tonight. <laughs> This says toys. So we'll see if there's toys in here. We got Frisbee. Student books. Oh, <laughs> what are we doing here? Wacky Walkers Alarm Clock. Or Wakers. Woof, woof, woof. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more. <laughs> That's funny. Gotta be worth a few bucks, right, Jeff? Yeah, I'm, I'm not thinking they're paying for your locker yet. Oh, come on. Oh, you are so due to open one of those. I am so due. You're right on that, Jeff. 300 boxes. What the heck is this thing? <clears throat> oh, the door stop. Miles holding the door. That's nice. That's neat. That's cool. That is cool. A few, bu a few bucks. Faraday flashlight two piece set. It was from Alex to Ken. Pocket radio. There's more jewelry boxes down here, dude. Huh. So, once again, trying to do the math. This locker is 10 by 10 and 7 feet tall. That's 700 cubic feet. Oh, look at that. 700 cubic feet. Yep. Brand new if your window. boxes are 2 cubic feet each, that's 350 boxes. I don't know if you had that many, but I bet you were over 200 and pushing 250 boxes in here. Oh, put that with your Christmas gifts. With a D. You just got to wrap that one. Oh, yeah, just got to wrap it up. Personal stuff. Ooh, we got a flag. This could be good. Uh huh. Wee wee wee. The French flag. Is, is that what that is? France. Oh. Three by good five. One. Good detective work. You don't again. know your French flags? I don't know a lot of flags. Uh oh. Look at this. Come on. I don't know. This might be the most empty jewelry boxes ever discovered in a storage unit. But they all make it. We just need one box that has yeah. it all in there. Right? We're down to 10 or 15 to go. Feng Feng Shui. The set tapes, alarm clock, and the French flag. This is usually I put my French flag with my alarm clock and empty jewelry boxes. All right, here's some more record albums. Patrick Juvon. We're having a record auction coming up, so. 
Saturday Night Fever, Bravo, the last summer. In good condition, right? Yeah, those two records in one pretty good condition. Oh, nice. Police, Aquarius, the Monkees. Those are all the titles you want to find in here. Patrick Juvon, David Bowie, Jane Birkin, Moonford, Beans Board. So I don't know about some of these, but ABBA. I know there's definitely some money here. Bob Seeger. Brian Adams, Summer of 69. Roger Daltrey, The Who in there, Jim Crow's, Queen. John Plummer. Car Wash, The Who, so all over the board, Fleetwood Mac, Savannah, Blood Rock, Average White Band, Jesus Christ Superstar, The Birds, Police, Sting, more Cheech and Chong, Robin Tower, so definitely some money, full of records here. Voyage. Very sweet. So not a bad little thing of heart and all. So once again I would have to take guess that this is probably at least a two hundred dollar box. Could be more. But records are always good when you find them, especially rock records. Oh and stuff like that. So we did find lots of jewelry boxes, so there's always a chance one of these boxes could have jewelry in it. Could go. Yeah, there's a chance they couldn't either. Yeah, they're right. There's a chance they could have jewelry boxes. <laughs> oh, look at this. That's cool. The lamp globe. I like it. I like it too. LED illuminated fountain. Then we got videos, VHS tapes, DVDs. Look at number 34, one clock. Spring 1978. So we're finding all kinds of stuff. We appreciate you guys watching. Oh, look at that. Silver plate. You never know what we're going to find, what you're going to see. Yeah, check out all the other videos. Little Playboy. There's an old coin. Really old coin. Definitely some cool stuff. Ooh, hoo, hoo, come on. I found a watch. Looks like an old one. Stainless steel back though. Look at this. We are down we're down to this left in the locker and you're still not giving up. I'm not giving up. You're still digging hard, man. That's what I like about you. I like your spirit. I like my spirit too. And I appreciate all my all the people out there watching. A little airing. So you find more treasures we'll show you guys but thanks for watching enjoy the day and who knows what we'll find next